Enid Green Mickelson, formerly Enid Green Waldholtz, born June 5, 1958, is a politician from the state of Utah who served one term in the United States House of Representatives. She was the third woman and first Republican woman elected to Congress from Utah. Since her retirement in 1997, no woman was elected to Congress from Utah until Mia Love in 2014. Topic: <laughs> Early Life. Green was born in San Rafael, California to naval officer and financier D. Forrest Green and Gerda Marie Bayer. She is one of five children. She graduated from East High School and earned her B.A. from the University of Utah in 1980. She received her law degree from Brigham Young University in 1983. She worked as a lawyer for software company Noval and then at a Salt Lake City law firm. She was deputy chief of staff for Governor Norman H. Bangerta. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Career While serving as chair of the Young Republican National Federation YRNF, Enid met Joe Waldholtz and they were soon in a relationship. Green ran for the House of Representatives in 1992 against Karen Shepard for the Utah 2nd District, which was entirely contained in Salt Lake County at that time, losing by four percentage points. Green married Waldholtz in 1993. After her marriage, Green took the name Enid Green Waldholtz. During her 1994 rematch against Shepard, Joe acted as her campaign manager. Her campaign spent approximately $2 million, the most expensive house race in the country that year. Green was swept into the 104th Congress in the Republican landslide in November. She was named to the House Rules Committee, the first freshman on that committee in over 80 years, and considered to be a potential rising star in the party. In March 1995, she announced she was pregnant. Green became the second representative to ever give birth while in office the first being Yvonne Braithwaite Burke and the first Republican. <laughs> <laughs> Scandal Her term was marred with scandal as her campaign was accused of campaign finance violations. Almost $1.8 million of the money spent in the 1994 campaign came from her husband, Joe, who had embezzled nearly $4 million from her father. Joe Waldholtz disappeared in November 1995 for six days before surrendering to police. During that time she announced that she was suing for divorce, for custody of her daughter, and to change her name back to Enid Green. Under pressure from Utah Republicans, she announced on March 5, 1996 that she would not seek re-election to Congress. Joe Waldholtz pleaded guilty to federal charges of tax, bank, and campaign fraud, and then, while out on parole, was subsequently convicted of forging insurance and veterans' affairs checks from his stepmother and his late father. He was sentenced to 3 to 15 years in prison. Renewal 
Green has slowly made her way back up the state Republican ladder in Utah. In 2003, she was elected vice chair of the Utah Republican Party. Green was a candidate for Lieutenant Governor of Utah in 2004, but her ticket with gubernatorial candidate Nolan Carras was unsuccessful, garnering only 34% of the vote in the Republican primary. After losing in the primary, Green went back to being state party vice chairwoman. She became acting chair of the Utah Republican Party upon the resignation of Joe Cannon in November 2006, and was unanimously elected to serve as state party chair in February 2007 until the next convention in June 2007. Enid Green remarried in 2008 to then Sheriff's Deputy, and current Judge, Scott J. Mickelson. She was a delegate at the 2012 Republican National Convention, served as chair of the 2016 Republican National Convention Site Selection Committee, and was recently appointed by RNC Chair Reince Priebus as chair of the 2016 Republican Convention Rules Committee. Electoral history Asterisk write in and minor candidate notes. In 1992, Eileen Koshik of the Socialist Workers' Party received 650 votes. See also Women in the United States House of Representatives equals equals notes.